want to know donkey, donkey, who Charlemagne donkey, the God's donkey, donkey, donkey of the day is. Donkey. First of all, you know he love. He's a Cowboys he's a fan. Cowboy. Dallas Cowboys and fan. DJ Envy on the um on the Breakfast Club mm -hmm. was trying to clown him because the Packers beat them so bad, Dallas Cowboys, and they didn't make it into the playoffs. They got this far, and and, and Charlemagne it. pretty much said, if you have a losing team that's not in the um, playoffs, he don't want you to say nothing. DJ Envy has the Giants. He said, y'all never make it and you're a loser. So don't even talk about the... Uh, you know, we Chicago, we ain't saying nothing. So he, he would tell us not and to they, say nothing. The backers just beat us. He would say, Chicago, you shouldn't even say nothing about the thing. But you know what? I am going to say something. Chicago had a chance to make sure the Packers didn't make it to this. And we blew that. And we blew that. Oh, well. But you know what, Charlemagne... People still gonna laugh whether we all we all sitting at home. Our teams didn't make it, but we and still your laughing team at did. yours. Just because yours went farther, they're still sitting at home, like all of us. In fact, I'm laughing harder at your team because your team had a good had a good record, and you blew it, and you blew it. Our team didn't have no good record, so we knew we wasn't going. We go in knowing we losers. Thank you. <laughs> but Packers, you guys are like me. Lucy and Charlie Brown. Jason. Putting the ball and down and then poking it up when you think you're going to kick other, it. What's that Aaron guy? The other Aaron guy. I know you're talking about. They, I sat there and watched the game and I went, your eyes would just do this at, at each uh, touchdown. It said they ended with Green Bay Packers winning 48 over 32. And it would have been worse than that if Dallas hadn't gotten two touchdowns. Dallas <laughs> Cowboys picked the worst possible time to lose the their first game in almost two full seasons. And they didn't just lose, they were slaughtered. The worst time. It would have been worse had they not got those two touchdowns at the in the fourth quarter. So remember I didn't we didn't do the story. Remember I was gonna do the story on all the coaches switching all these oh, different yeah, places? Yeah. Well, you know Bill Belichick is gone. Right. Is so, he going to another team? Now? No, no, no. He's looking. He's done. Okay. Now, um, now New England Patriots has a black coach, uh -oh. and he's the youngest, the youngest coach. Okay. In in um the in the season or whatever okay. in NFL. Okay. okay. Um. So you know, and our friends, um, uh, uh Malone and them, mm -hmm. Maloney. What's his what name? What about her? That's her team. So oh they, they yeah, 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 they yeah. Winning. They winning. Okay. I felt bad for um. Um, I I switched over and I watched the um, Philadelphia game and they lost Philadelphia against the the, the, the uh, Buccaneers, the Tampa. Mm -hmm. And I felt bad because I like Jason Hurt mm -hmm. and um, that other brother to the one that's dating um, Taylor Swift. Mm -hmm. I felt bad for them because they had a good record too All and right. they lost. Well, anyway, Charlemagne was talking about the fact that Bill Belichick is out looking for a team. Mm -hmm. He wants him to go to Dallas. He does, but I don't think that's gonna happen. He should go to Chicago, cause I I don't want the coach in Chicago to stay. They're even talking about getting rid of our quarterback. Wow, they're not talking about getting rid of the coach though, are they? Which yeah. they should. Yeah, cause our our team two years we've had bad record. They need to get rid of him and the quarterback. I don't have a problem with our quarterback, but he should come to our team. No, he wants to win. No, he can help the team win. That's just wrong. You're gonna go to a winning team. They don't need him if he's if winning. They're not already. a winning team. They missing something. They lost against the uh, Packers. But they had a good record. It okay. wasn't like they was not like our record. Well, whatever. Uh -huh. so, so Bill Bell to go there. He wants him to go there. He gave Donkey of the Day to um the Dallas, Dallas. Cowboys um owner, mm -hmm. who we all know. Forgot his name. Y'all know who we're talking about. Johnson. Y'all know who the Dallas Cowboy mm -hmm. owner is. I remember the old one. Yes. Lowry. No, no. You talking about coach. Oh, coach. Oh, no, I'm sorry, coach. Um, but he wants Bill Belichick to go to Dallas. No, nah, hopefully go to Chicago. And help, he gave, help Chicago. And he gave uh, Donkey of the Day to the owner, Jerry. That's it, Johnson. Okay. And um, he says, <laughs> and to them for losing. And he, again, he's a Dallas Cowboy fan. <laughs> and DJ Envy was laughing like what you was. And he <laughs> called him a loser because he's with the New York Giants. And he said, oh, you guys God. are always losers. They better than we, us. <laughs> yeah, they better than us. Okay. So that's the donkey of the day. Okay. Aw. 
I didn't know he was a Dallas Cowboy. Um, oh, he's a fan. Dallas Cowboy fan. Okay. Dallas Cowboy is an American team. They yeah. like the Steelers. Pittsburgh Steelers. Yeah, it's like the Steelers. Yeah. So there well, you go. Yeah. Green Bay. The one thing, the only shining light that I liked in the in the in the fact that Green Bay won mm-hmm. is I don't like their old quarterback, Aaron Rodgers. And I just wanted them to show we don't need you, Aaron Rodgers, yeah. to win. See so how that was alone. one of the see how it's still alone. that's one of okay that was one of the things that I was kind of happy about the cheese heads and all of that because I'm not a cheese head fan right but I didn't like when he said he owned us when he was playing with them you see the mask behind you no I but go ahead see. keep going so that was right one there of, that was one of my shining moments is that um Aaron if they putting it in Aaron Rodgers face we got a good team we got a good quarterback we don't need you yeah and they're the youngest team. Yeah. out there so all right so that's it